Hi everyone, I'll be showing a quick video on how to upgrade the firmware of a Fronius Gen 24 Primo inverter. So let's get right into it. So uh, basically I am at solarweb.com. I have logged in using my account. So currently um, it's um, nighttime here and uh, it's not generating power. So to upgrade the uh, firmware of my Fronius inverter, it's uh, under settings column or settings tab and then components and uh, from components there will be an option to select the um, the model or uh, my product which is uh, this one so it's a gen 24 and uh, all i have to do is select it and choose the update button so again it's uh, under uh, settings components and I'll be selecting the uh, the unit or the product that I have which is a uh, Fronius Gen 24 Primo and select the uh, select the product and click update and it would uh, uh, prompt you to uh, for this uh, quick information that Fronius has developed further improvements and an update is now available for your system. So, la so this would take a, f um, a few minutes and all you have to do is click on start update. And yeah, apparently that's uh, how, um, how fast uh, it is. It just uh, take a few seconds, but uh, yeah um i'll try to uh figure out um which how to check the current uh, firmware but as you can see um if i go to components uh, a while ago it's showing an option for an update but um yeah after clicking the update yeah there's no yeah it seems that uh, this is the firmware probably so correct me if i'm wrong guys on the uh, comment section below but uh yeah so that seems to be updated now so yeah that will be uh that would be all see you in the next one seems the update is still running so i'm not sure though what this uh, row 1.35.4-1 means but uh, with this uh, circle icon, so it seems to be still pending the firmware update. So I'll wait for a few um, seconds or minutes. It took a few minutes to get completed, but uh, right now it says uh, latest firmware already installed. But um, just I've noticed uh, that's actually for the data sources. So it seems that for the actual inverters, um, in case there's a new firmware update, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, guys, uh, it should appear here. But uh, there's none. And yeah, apparently uh, everything is uh, good. So again, it's under settings and under components. And yeah, you'll have, if there's a new firmware available, um, you'll be presented with an option for update here. Okay, so yeah, it's all good.